Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel in another video where we are looking at some of the changes coming up in version 2004 or the May 2020 update coming up in a few weeks to a PC near you. So in the next version of Windows 10, we have some new options in the uh, accounts settings. And you can go, of course, into your settings going into the quick actions and all settings. You can go into the start menu click the uh, click the settings gear and go into accounts one of the first changes was in the fact that so here you can create your picture you see at the top there's a picture this is your account picture and it reflects upon all of devices that are actually logged in with the Microsoft account you're using so every device Every app that is connected to your Microsoft account should have the same picture. Problem was, for a long time, when you would change the picture, it took a very long time to change everywhere, and even some apps wouldn't change at all. Now it's better. So if you create a picture using the camera, or you browse for a picture on your PC to put as your profile picture, that now will actually be faster in updating to every PC and device that you're using with your Microsoft account. The other thing that is a new in 2004 is now you have the ability to actually require Windows to only use hello type sign in uh, for Microsoft. What is hello sign in? Instead of using a password, and sometimes some of us use really, you know, like I do, I use really complex and long passwords. Um, it's, of course, uh, you know, tedious job, a big job to enter the password everywhere all the time. Well, with the hello sign-in, it actually will use an alternative way of logging you in. So it could be with a face, uh, with fingerprint, or a pin. In my case, it's a pin that I use. So that, when it's on, actually forces you to use one of those options, making it a little easier for you to actually log in. I find that using a pin is fun because it's fast. And it doesn't, of course, it still means your accounts are safe with a very big password if you're uh, keeping you know, your accounts safe with really complex passwords. But with the login on your PCs and devices with the Microsoft account, this actually now uses a pin. Also, what is new is in safe mode, when you would go in safe mode, you would have to enter your password before because it wanted the password. And that created some problems because some people forgot your passwords because they've been using a pin, for example, or Windows Hello face recognition all the time and they kind of lost their password. Well, now that uh, will allow you to actually enter with your uh, favorite uh, Windows Hello sign in. So that means no more, you know, requiring of your password when you're in the safe mode of Windows 10. And last but not least, restart apps. You now have the ability to tell Windows, do you want to restart the apps or not when you actually log out or log in to your accounts. So if you sign out, some apps were open. If you this, if this is on, most of the apps will actually restart, reopen to where they were when you actually signed out of your account. This, of course, can be turned off if you do not wish to have the apps restart um, when you sign out. And of course, you also have uh, use my sign in info to automatically finish setting up my device after an update and restart option is also something that has been tweaked and is new in 2004. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.